himself away in the corner. He's going to give his position away just a little bit here. Oh, and does get spotted, but he has dropped down. Nice use of the abilities. He's completely confused. Shao's able to take him down. This puts us into the 3v2. And Meadow, he's in a great spot. But will it pay off? Piff's making a lot of noise. It's expected, but Piff, he's a monster. He's a madman with it. The right clicks come through. Two versus two. Shao's got to be careful. He gets caught slipping. This is not what they want to see. Shadow all alone, and he's done so much in this round. But can he finish it off? He doesn't quite want to poke into it. He manages to pull off the reload, but Piff lands the headshot. Smokes, Nade's going to push Panatech away. He's going to bounce back into the B site. Meadow started off on the kill on Mixer. That's a big pickup. And now they've got site control, but Piff's going to hold in the back lines. There's two players there, but they've both fallen. Shadow's wrecked them. Clean as you like. FPX have found their way in. Oh, this is going to have his position revealed for now. No way. No way back in. This is yeah. a hell of an answer by FPX. Pilots have to get away with doing some huge damage here. Manchester chime with the first on the second as well. He's getting it done, but Zipan lands the headshot. It's a slow push in. Mixwell's oh. the only defender. He sprays down two while well, he's completely flashed. Eventually, he's taken out, but it doesn't even matter. Piff had already rotated. Ronaldo's playing close range with the judge. It's very dangerous for these FPX players. They start to poke round, and he still gets it done. Oh, this cheeky. He's going to be spammed up. He might even be able to try and go in for another kill, but Shadow... He's got other ideas about it now. Already Patatex worked his way over, but he needs to be careful as well. He's heavily outnumbered and just will back away. Not worth committing towards that fight, but Mixwell, he goes in for it, punished. As the stun to the right side prompts David P to swing wide, he thinks he can catch an early flank, but instead he catches bullets right between his teeth. And unfortunately, it, it doesn't quite work the way it does in cartoons. <laughs> you can't stop it. It's not possible. They tested it. I saw them. Oh, nice. Episode. Pith, though. Timing. He's busting up some heads. They'll be ready for an early retake. Oh, they don't timing. Think they can deny this spike plan. Surely not. No. He's now safe behind the box. Might catch him when he pops his head up. There we go. Oh, oh. beautiful stuff. Ending past that is, is six, uh, wild success. Considering how strong the defense is. Here we go. The ult through, but it's dodged and returned by Ooh. Artis. He doesn't get anything either, but the head is connected, and that's all they needed. Meadow trying desperately to pull it back, but it's a 2v4, and they've got no access to the site with three players in position. Oh, Piff. He's got the information, but he's not going to find the kills. Meadow's able to deal with him, but Meadow is super low now. Mixwell playing towards the back of the site. He's going to try and land this shot. He's a bit low himself. Misses the first. It's less than ideal. He gets blinded off the back of it. Oh, Patatek swings just as Shadow gets caught by the tripwire. And it's just not looking good for FPX. Mixwell waiting for someone to step into his sight. Oh, great use of the ult. Forcing everyone out of positions. Mixwell can't challenge it just yet. Oh, but oh. Patatek double the kills. Managing to lock it down. Mixwell's hungry for more, but it's now all on Zipan. It's a 1v1. He's got one player to find. It's Piff. He's been huge for G2 so many times, and he does it once again. Lane only loses a little bit of health, though. And Rolling Thunder comes into play. Shao trying to make it work with the Hunter's Fury, but all that's happening is the rest of his teammates are going down. Oh, this onto Angel. He doesn't even know what's going on around him. It's a 5v2, and FPX, they have been halted at every step of the way. Angel's just stood in a smoke in that round and gets smacked in the face by a showstopper. That's, <laughs> that's the worst way to go. I hope we get a replay of this cam. <laughs> I, I don't reckon he was all too happy when that one went down. They're hunting him. They're coming after Shell. They don't want him to save over this weapon, and pow! One for one was going to benefit the attack inside as they continue to push on forward. David P is trying to escape. Meadow's taking out Mixwell, but Piff, he's waiting in the wings. He's down below. He pops the ult, and he wants to ensure that this is going to be a dominant first half. 3v2 in G2's favor, but David P is incredibly low. Piff's still hanging down below, but he's not done yet. So unlucky, so unfortunate. It's going to take something incredible from this young man to try and grab this round for his team, but that's the start they would have wanted. But that was David P who was already very low. Patatex already starting to rotate over. Charge once again, Mitch. 
Yeah, they absolutely oh, are. They're proven. Oh, oh, oh. Now, this is the number one team in Europe right now, and they are not taking any questions on number two stepping up to take that map. We are looking at a... Oh, Shadow! Shadow, what was that, man? Let's nice go. Spot. He's looking for more. He's not finding any victims, and he's so low, but Meadow's there doing the work in the back lines. His artist comes in for more. At two versus one, the Sova trying to pull this back. Shadow up on top in the rafters. He's all the way in the corner. Oh, he's pulled off the angle, but he's still got the chance. Hasn't been peaked just yet. He might catch him off guard, but that was so bad. No problem at all for G2 to get in there. Shadow's trying to catch him. He hears it, he sees it, but he can't fire any shots just yet. He'll start off with one, but he needs a lot more than that. Wait for his team's backup. The Pat Attack's there to take the fight. Shao's going to be able to do one better for now, but it's still an even Stevens duel. Angel! <laughs> what Sheriff shots! For the side of FPX, they're straight into the B side. Zipan hoping to make some magic happen, but he puts the boom bot out and gets shot in the back. Artis was there ready and waiting. Mixwells are getting up close and personal, and he's not finished yet. He's going in with the knives, but Angel wants to put an end to it. The FPX team are trying to push back, but it's coming down to these jewels. There's a lot of 1v1 fights going in. He's on the hunt. He's trying to make it work, but Shadow got to be cautious. Working his way through. David P's position is going to be known now. So no flank attempt to come in here. He's dealing away with it, but he's not going to get any kills. Angel up high. He's got Shao to back him up. They're trying to pop the ult down. Patatek smartly gets the head out of there. Both players need to start making a move. They need to get on top of that spike. Oh, the ult is up already. It's getting done. Oh, it's just not possible. It's going to go the way of G2 and Artis. There's a great amount of flashes coming out from Shadow, but he needs to deliver some oh. kills. Chow's already been dropped, and Shadow's left alone on the back of the side. Angel's coming through to try and provide a little bit of support, but he goes down. So too does Shadow, and it might have started out with Chow picking up the opening duel, but now they've got to come all the way back into a 2v4. Zipan, just a sheriff in play. He's doing okay damage to Palatech, but the blast packs aren't enough to even make him one hit to the sheriff. This is tall. Oh, Time is low. Spikes on the site, though, so no problem. And a 1v4 that just cannot be won. And, like, I'm pretty yeah. sure that, that they just underestimated them massively. And by the time they realized, oh, this seems legit, it was too late. David P's opened it up straight away. A little bit of aggression. He walled himself up and got Whoa. the kill on the site. Angel, what is that? A triple oh. quad kill. He what? has shut them down. Oh, my word. But he doesn't want to overextend just yet. He wants to hold on to the position they've got right now. And Ardis is only going to strengthen it. Shadow goes down. Mixwell can back away. And Shao, he hears the footsteps. He's waiting for the timing. But he's only going to get one. Mixwell ready and waiting for it. Like, well, if I can, if I can just yeah. get one kill. If I can just one shot. We heard that ult on being taken. Oh, here comes the wall up on top. David P, good for another. Second time in this game, he's gotten away with that already. Coming into round number four, but Shao's oh. left on check. Shot in the back and taken down before he can get any more. And with that, they are going to get that spike planted again. FBX are locked out. And again, they could have money to buy up if they save now. But Angel's looking for an opportunity. He just needs to be given a chance. And that B site, once it's lost, is so hard to retake. FPX being very cautious on how they want to push through it. But David P, he is not. He's good for one, but it doesn't really matter as they've still got a huge advantage here for the G2 side. Angel hoping someone else might poke out. He's trying to spam up the obvious positions, but no shots are going to connect just yet as Mixwell deals away with Meadow. Angel holding the line, but it doesn't even matter because FPX need to make a move for this. They're down a man already. Smoke's giving Mixwell enough cover to play off of here. Shao straight in with the jaw. Oh, wow. He dominates the first. Patatek's able to hold on to the rest, though. They're trying to push on through. The flash is going up, but Mixwell still sits in the corner. Had Sage have had her old healing, David P would have been 100 health, and he wouldn't have died from that first blast. Oh, nicely done here as Mixwell tries to jet ult his way to success. Instead, he's caught in between two players. But is it even going to matter? Artist clearing out all the corners, wants to work his way around and comes to back up Piff. Meadow trying to shoot up strong and some really nice sheriff shots continue to be landed. He's not done yet. 
the spike will be planted. But Ardis and Padatek, they're certainly under pressure. The camera goes up, but it's going to reveal his position. Padatek having to get the reload on. He could be forced out. Both players pushing around him. They need to be oh so cautious. He's going to be stunned for now. But Padatek, Ooh. you monster! Headshot! And then into the kill. Shao goes down on Paratech. He's looking to make the magic happen. They're dancing around each other. And Shadow will fall. But you still got the rest of G2 to deal with. David P from up high once again being an absolute nuisance. They're falling all over the place. The revive comes in because David P is picking up so many kills. It's kind of an overkill or an over revive. Meadow will be able to pick up one. But his position is shortly going to be known. He doesn't have much health. They are looking to punish these players. And this could get dangerous real quick. They've got the info now on exactly where G2 are, but now they've got to deliver the kill. Oh. Zipan, he whipped it. No, Zipan. That is so unlucky. That is so unfortunate. He throws his grenades out, but he's not going to find any success. Artist ready and waiting for him. And Piff could check to look for another flank that might be coming in. Now, this would be an easy one, Padatek. Oh, be going down, but Shadow's holding on with that trigger discipline. No other players go up towards him just yet. And for Shadow, yes, it's a kill, but it's nothing that's going to seal the deal. 3v1 spike down, and Shadow's best hope is to hold on to his weapons. Stop Darth going out around him. David P swings on him. Oh, oh Shadow. Nice aim. Good control. Still Piff to find. He's able to do it. G2 were inside it. They were ready. And it feels like at the moment, Absolutely anything that FPX are trying, G2 already know. They've got their strap work open in front of them. I don't know, maybe there's a third brother that's just been sat in the in the in the gym in the background <laughs> listening into everything going on, but something's happening here. You said gym, so it's definitely not Tom. I know he's advertising for the position. <laughs> and G2 right now, well they've been in the gym lifting all the weights on their fingers. Attack inside, a bit more tactical sided, but maybe they just need a team talk right now. Of boy, oh, oh, there oh. we go. Well, we talked about important kills being needed a double or nothing that'll work out. One shot, two kills that's more than just sealing the deal. That's giving you a great chance in this round. Surely, this is the one for him. Mixwell pokes out, puts himself oh. up high, but Angel he's showing us he's still got what it takes. Paratech will eventually deal with him. As soon as he heard the updraft, he flicked up. He knew he knew what was coming. At this point as well, Zipan has heard that shadow step. He knows that the omen is around here towards the head. Area Paratech. Okay, he's got one, but 15 seconds. Time to go. And they've got two players sat down on long. This should be it. This should be it secure. No way they lose this one. No way. No way, Banks. I don't believe it. He's got the ult up as well on Zipan. Great use of the grenades coming out. Piff trying to hold on, but it's not going to work out. Zipan did go and kill. Coming into the A site early on. Three players already there. David P's pushing up. Mixwell's missing some key shots. It's less than ideal, but he's done some damage at least. He's now got a good idea of what's going on. Patatek and Piff are delivering. Zipan needs to do a hell of a lot more than just the one grenade. And Piff! Oh! <laughs> Piff! That's unreal. Because to all intents and purposes, this could be a mix. G2 could oh, yeah. be a mix. You look at them. Like, <laughs> in reality, they are. I, they still are, because they, like, what did David P say? Oh, yeah, we don't practice for anybody. <laughs> we don't, we're just the best team in the world. Do you guys practice? Nah. Nah, we just kind of play. I think they've, yeah. they've proven that. Mate, I'm, I, I want to see who can challenge them worldwide. I can't wait for that to go down. Meadow will at least put up a bit of a challenge onto Mixwell, but still three more players to find and a spike plant. They can just rush you from start to finish. His position is not going to be directly revealed just yet, but it may not even matter. Piff goes down and he's still swinging on him, but no time to plant now because of it. Well, yeah, you could say that. There's a lot of things you could say about FPX right now, but G2, I'm going to sit in the side of positivity and say this is the goddamn best team in the world. They are so damn good. It is a pleasure to watch them every step of the way. Oh, look at this, Hunter's Fury oh. doing the damage, highlighting the players. Shao trying to pull. Oh, nice shot. Pushing through the smoke. He picks up one, but up close there was one. And as he tried to deal with the tripwire, he tripped over himself. Seven seconds, no time left. And that is the uh, end of the game.